Because there are clear learning intentions and success criteria, it's very easy to know whether your lesson is progressing well. Um, at the end of the lesson, you would judge the work of the children to the learning intention. But as the lesson progresses, you can use the success criteria for mini plenaries to stop what the children are doing and to say, right, are we on track? Does this meet the success criteria that we spoke about at the beginning? So, for example, on the lesson uh, on Patrick Coalfield's still life painting, um, some of the success criteria that we were asking the children was, one, does it look like Patrick Coalfield's work? Two, have you used bright and bold colours? And three, at the end of the lesson, have you used dark outlines around each of the shapes that you've painted? I always tend to leave the success criteria on the whiteboard, which means that both myself and the children can refer back to it and see whether we are on the right tracks. 